50. 51. What was your card? Five of diamonds. Growing inside the banana. It's the five of diamonds. <laughs> oh, oh man. man, entertainment might be an understatement. What happens to someone who loses on America's Got Talent? He suffers from something called reptile dysfunction and becomes one of Variety's 10 comics to watch. He's been dazzling audiences with his nightly spellbinding show at the Flamingo in Las Vegas. He's got a new comedy special and can be seen on stage at Clues Memorial Hall. We're so excited to welcome 50% comedian, 50% magician, and 100% dragon, Pip the Magic Dragon, his dog, Mr. Pip, and Hello. also his beautiful, 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 <laughs> beautiful. <laughs> associate there as well. You guys have to be having so much fun in Vegas. Yeah, we love it in Vegas. We've been here almost seven years now, and uh, we just re-signed for another three years. Oh, well, all right. Okay. Safe to say people are liking what they're seeing from you guys. So I'm wondering, yeah. I'm wondering if you've encountered much dragon discrimination mm. on your climb to the top. Mm -hmm. How's that yeah, uh, Game of Thrones has made it very difficult to be <laughs> a mythical creature in America right now. A lot of people think I'm going to burn down their village. Oh. <laughs> well, he, he I've seen like some conversations. I, is, it, is it really too hot to be a dragon in Las Vegas? Mm. How does no, that work for you? No, because dragons are cold-blooded. <laughs> So the desert is the perfect environment. You know, speaking of, of being in the perfect environment, I mean, you're going to be on stage at Clues Memorial Hall here in Indianapolis yeah. on October 28th. What can fans expect to see from the show? We're going to do uh, all new tricks, all new tricks, all new jokes, same dog. But, you know, if you like what we did on America's Got Talent, if you like what we did on Penn and Telephorus, and if you don't know who we are, then you can just go and watch Reptile Dysfunction on YouTube. Uh, it's an hour of your life. You'll never get back. And uh, you can make your mind up. See, hey, maybe this is for you. So we're also touring with uh, one of our best friends, Puddles Pity Party, who's a seven foot tall singing clown. Excuse oh. me? Mm. A seven foot tall clown that sings. YouTube. Puddles Pity Party. <laughs> he was on America's Got Talent too. People love him. You're going to love him. He sings uh, all these like classic songs, but in his own style. It's incredible. I that's love crazy. it. Okay. All right. Now you mentioned YouTube. You've got a show on your YouTube channel that's getting gangbuster streams. What's yeah. that like? Yeah, it's great. We put the special out on YouTube and it's blowing up. And uh, that's great. You know, it's a way for us to connect directly with the fans. You don't have to subscribe to Netflix. You don't have to work out to get on Disney Plus. You just go straight to the source on YouTube. So, Piff, when did you know about your magic powers, right? <laughs> like, when did you know that you had these magic powers that would make people laugh? Like, what, is it when you were a little dragon? Was it yeah, when you were a teenage hatched. dragon? <laughs> when I hatched out of the egg. But it's not just me who has the magic powers. It's Mr. Piffles, too. For example, earlier today, Mr. Piffles turned over one card in this check. Deck, just a single card, one card. Okay, you're going to name it. Just name any card. Oh, name it? Two of hearts. Yeah. You sure? Uh, King of Diamonds. No, no, we've had the decision. It's okay. the Two of Hearts. Oh, mm -hmm. Two of Hearts. Mm -hmm. He only turned over one card. All right, Randall? Okay. One card. He's face down. All the other cards the same way round, except for one card just here. Oh. Okay. Oh, that is wait a minute, wild. Now. Wait a minute. That now. is wild, y'all, because I literally just said that off the top of my head because I don't even play cards. So yes. I was just trying to figure out what <laughs> would be that. To say. That is Good crazy. Good job, Mr. Piffles. Good job. <laughs> Look at that. Piffles. <laughs> That was he, wild. He, he barely even cares. <laughs> He's like, I do this. I do this. Yeah. It's, it's not this is like, what I do. <laughs> what did you expect? <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. Well, man, we're looking forward to it so much. Clues Memorial Hall. Piff the Magic Dragon is appearing, and it's going to happen at 8 o'clock that night. Man, mm -hmm. what a, what a, October 28th. You guys have to be there. You know, Piff, anytime you want to come on pull in, up on us. we'll just have you guys here in Show house. Some of the magic. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah, next time we're touring, we're going to come down in person. I love it. Ooh, I love it. We're going to hold you to it. Well, break a leg out there. All three of you. <laughs> All three of you. All Thank you very much. <laughs> We're going to bring it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man, that was good. That was good. You got you got both of us. I, Were you watching them, though, the whole time? Yes. I, Y'all, I, I swear to you, I just was trying to think of what was in the car, Jack. <laughs> that was impressive.